Well guys, you'll notice something. Forerunner's not in here. But what is in here is my Cummins. Friggin' right. So I got the head and the block here. Intercooler and the rag because I didn't want anybody to steal them. So uh, yeah, I ripped them out with the help of my brother. <laughs> we also got my engine crane here so I can uh, lift her up. What I gotta do is I gotta get some new boards because I freaking I hate the dirt floor, it sucks. But um, So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get a couple more pieces of plywood, lay them down, and then uh, start tearing this thing apart. Um, you guys have already seen the first half of it, so uh, I gotta get all the freaking valves and freaking springs and whatnot out of there. And then I gotta just tear this thing right apart, so I'm gonna use my friggin' engine crane to move it around and whatnot, and uh, yeah, I'm gonna have fun getting that fan off, because this uses that stupid friggin' thing, but uh, anyways, yeah, big, big thanks to my brother. Uh -huh. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> yeah. Okay, well, thank you for your help. Yeah. Alright. But, uh, yeah, so anyways, friggin' right. Just wanted to get you guys a little friggin' update as to what's going on, so, uh, yeah. Anyways, guys, I'm friggin' dirtier as frig. Look, you can tell. I was friggin' laying down on the engine block to friggin' get the uh, bell housing bolts out. So, um, yeah, I got the friggin' engine block home, so now it's time to friggin' start the tear down. Friggin', friggin', friggin'. Uh, <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so I gotta uh, tear it apart. I'm gonna label everything. Where is it? There. All the all the different cylinders and stuff. I gotta friggin' keep all the stuff separate. Uh, I gotta get new rings for the pistons. Uh, what else? I'm really debating sending my uh, pistons out to uh, um, Contagious Diesel Performance, the guys that I bought my injectors from, uh, to have them uh, cut out the uh, what is it? D-lip delip the pistons so I think it makes just a bigger bowl for the, the fuel because I got big big freaking injectors so I don't know it might mess with my compression a little bit that's why I'm kind of a little bit leery about it but uh, freaking mosquitoes everywhere mosquitoes but uh, yeah so anyways I'm gonna start the tear down I'm gonna document everything that way you guys have a lot of stuff to watch and uh, apologize for not uh, freaking just making videos and stuff. I've been really freaking busy and just freaking stressed out over a whole bunch of crap. So, uh, but anyways, that's starting to rectify itself. So, now I got more projects, and uh, I'm bringing the freaking lawnmower in. The uh, the old Ford. She's getting a freaking makeover pretty soon. So, I just gotta get my welder here. Gotta get my plasma cutter here, and uh, I gotta run a 240 line from the house to the shop. So. Uh, and then I'm freaking in business, except I just realized that I need air for the plasma cutter. Uh, I guess I gotta rebuild my compressor too. But anyways, I just wanted to fire up a quick uh, update video for you guys, so... Uh, thanks for watching, and until next time, take care.